Behind this door, an ordinary family is starting an ordinary day. Behind all these ordinary activities, there's something extraordinary. Nowadays, vitamins are made with the bioprocess using living cells and enzymes to make vitamins identical to those found in fruit and vegetables. It was biotechnology that came to the rescue when a devastating viral infection struck the Hawaiian papaya industry. Did you know that biotech enzymes give the genes the stoned washed look without having to stone wash them? The smart enzymes made by genetically modified microorganisms in new biotech detergents have reduced washing temperatures to 30 Celsius or lower, saving energy while also dramatically cutting the amount of phosphates running into rivers. Biotech can also turn plants into bioplastics, like this cup, which is made entirely from corn material and is completely biodegradable and can be composted. This prototype car can run on 100% ethanol, a biofuel made from sugar. Most of the biodiesel source in Europe is from oilseed rape and is now being used in a small percentage in all diesel cars. Biotechnology can now also convert agricultural waste, known as biomass, into renewable energy or biofuels, which will give a new income to farmers. The first real biotech treatment for lymphoma cancer has meant no chemo or radiotherapy for this man. Patients like him are able to lead a normal life and can look forward to a healthy future. A new biotechnology medicine for rheumatoid arthritis, which targets the underlying causes of the disease, is giving better results for this woman who can now walk alone without help and without pain. These genetically modified carnations with their vibrant purple color are now being grown and sold throughout the world. Enzymes are now used to treat and cure leather. The bioprocess produces less waste, uses less energy and is also easier on the tanners. Originally developed for American cotton farmers, over 75% of farmers growing GM cotton are now from developing countries. Did you know that Euro notes are partly made from cotton? Biotechnology makes it possible to understand the underlying causes of diseases like multiple sclerosis. The first biotech treatments in the world have now been developed for multiple sclerosis, enabling patients to live more active lives for much longer. Around every corner there lies a biotech story. Biotechnology is touching almost every aspect of our lives. In Europe, almost 2,000 companies are advancing knowledge of biotechnology and life sciences. They are making products that provide new solutions to old problems. And biotechnology is so environmentally sound that people don't have to completely change lifestyles to be environmentally friendly. The Invisible Revolution is there to help you do it. <laughs>